grieving relatives overseas and friends here at home are telling us more about a convenience store clerk who was murdered two days ago. Ali Abbasi's death is making headlines in his native Pakistan. We're also getting a look at the man accused of killing him. Police say 18-year-old Devin Thacker was trying to rob the store in the 12,700 block of Medfield. 11 News reporter Sharon Min Chow spent the day at the scene and Sharon Min, you also spoke with the victim's family in Pakistan. We did. We spoke to his brother by phone who told us in English that he wants to call President Obama to ask for the maximum punishment. He said, since my brother cannot return to us, he wants the gunman to hang. The store, as you can see, remains behind, behind us remains closed with mementos posted outside. And while there is a suspect in custody, his friends here remain nervous and anonymous. With the click of a mouse, Ali Abbasi's friends can get news half a world away. This is his wedding photo in a leading daily Pakistani newspaper. Yeah, we're best friends. Monday's murder of a convenience store clerk is big news in his home province of Meher. There, he had another job. It is because uh, he was related to the journalism field and his family still belongs to the journalism field. And top of that, that uh, he was very active member of social organization here in uh, America. In custody is 18-year-old Devin Thacker. On Tuesday, a tip led authorities to his home about two miles from the store. Abbasi's family is fighting for the death penalty. And they are appealing our Pakistan consulate general to contact with the prison or, or judge or court. Friends hope to hold a local service Christmas Day at a West Side mosque, then ship Ali Abbasi's body back to Pakistan. They have been working all day to get the paperwork to ship his body back. Meantime, Devin Thacker faces a capital murder charge, which is a death penalty offense. At 6 o'clock, we'll bring you in for a closer look at some of the interesting mementos folks have left behind as a tribute to Ali Abbasi. For now, we are live in southwest Houston. Shunmin Chow, 11.